This episode of Techzilla Bytes is brought to you by Toyota's hydrogen fuel cell vehicles. Toyota, let's go places. Hey guys, I'm Shannon Morse and we just sat down and saw the Toyota press conference and I just wanted to relax for a bit and give you a nice little rundown of exactly what happened. So first up on stage, we had Michio Kaku. He came on and he's a physicist, but he's also a futurist. He, you've probably seen him in documentaries, to be honest, because he's, he's widely popular. He's a scientist. He's one of these guys that really knows his stuff, especially about this kind of technology. Well, he was here because he saw a Toyota Press release and he got super excited about it, but why? Well, it all comes down to hydrogen. For example, he quoted, this is the dawn of the age of hydrogen. But why hydrogen? Well, it, it's in 75% of the universe. You can find it everywhere that you're going to go, not only on our planet, but say if you're traveling in outer space, you can find it in stars, you can find it on other planets. It's everywhere. It's the kind of element that's not going to end up destroying our environment. He even gave this story about watching an old episode of Star Trek with Spock and Kirk going to this brand new planet and discovering this weird thing called smog. Michio Kaku wants to see smog erased from the dictionary. He doesn't want to see it in the dictionary anymore, and he thinks that this is the beginning of this new dawn of hydrogen. But what is this new and awesome technology that he's talking about? Well, it's called the Toyota Mirai. It's gonna be released in October and it's gonna cost around 50 grand. The thing about the perfect car is it has to have a couple of different items included with it. Now, of course, that includes the mileage, how far can you get in this thing? Well, it's, it's pretty on par with the current gas car that I have. It's gonna run 300 miles per tank of hydrogen fuel cell. So that's pretty awesome. Next up, he mentioned acceleration. Of course, that's really important to me because I wanna go the speed limit on the highway and this thing can get up to 60 miles per hour in nine seconds. And lastly, of course, how fast am I gonna be able to refuel it? Well, this thing is honestly a little bit faster than I can take to fill up my entire tank of gas. This thing will take three to five minutes to refuel the entire fuel cell. That's pretty amazing. But of course, with any new technology, there's gonna be a few caveats. And one of the big ones with this is infrastructure. Are there gonna be the stations available for this? Am I gonna be able to travel far and near with no issues and no worries about running out of my fuel cell power? Well, that's where we brought in Bob Carter, who is the Senior VP of Automotive Operations. Well, he came on stage and he discussed how exactly are we going to get there so that we can see this, this car in production all over the place. Well, first off, we started with California. So they are putting aside $200 million just for the infrastructure alone. We're going to see stations all across the state in a few years. That's pretty awesome as well. Now, the second part that he discussed was patents. So of course, if Toyota was just doing this by themselves, it would take a long time to see that full infrastructure, but they're pretty awesome with this. They're actually releasing 5,680 hydrogen fuel cell patents to everybody, royalty free. No matter what kind of cars you're building, no matter what kind of infrastructure, what kind of stations you wanna build, you can do it royalty free. They're not just keeping this all to themselves, they're letting anyone else do it. And this is gonna help build the infrastructure across the globe so, so much faster. And that's so important when you're trying to create this new technology. I love that about this. Now, last off, of course, production of this actual car. Well, they're hoping to see tens of thousands in production by the year 2020. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. I can't wait to see this thing on the road. So do you guys think that this is the beginning of the future? I kind of do, and I hope that it is. I would love to see this be the route that the future takes. I'm Shannon Morse, and this is the Toyota Mirai. This episode of Techzilla Bytes is brought to you by Toyota's hydrogen fuel cell vehicles. Toyota, let's go places.